What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. <laughs> now, before we get into this video, I want to talk to y'all about something brief. For those that don't know, the things that I react to, people send them to me. Like, literally. <laughs> Some people think people be lying about that, but I have people that send me shit on a daily basis. So, I go through it, and I react to it. Like, simple and plain. So, with that being said... This is how I found out um, that Jaden unfollowed Blueface. And I know y'all going to think it's petty. Like, that's petty. Let me tell y'all something. I want to speak briefly on how I feel about Jaden. Because in the past, I've said things about Jaden, especially like her not standing up on her two toes. Like, I just think you dislike Jaden. I think you hate Jaden. I don't know Jaden. Okay? How can you hate somebody you don't know? So with that being said, I want to say this. I'm so happy that Jaden decided to step up and take herself serious for once. Now, ultimately, I know y'all probably like she only doing that because he in jail. Good. I don't, you know, I don't know if Jaden is afraid. I don't know if, um, like she feels as though, you know, he got so much control over her. That she can't do certain things. Like she can't have certain people in the house. She can't. Her own house. She can't have men in her own house. She can't do certain things. Because he has so much control over her. Remember that's not a lie. Because Krishan said the same thing. If Krishan would have did so. He would have had certain control over her. Now Krishan wants to be under control again. I don't know. But anyway. With that being said. I want y'all to know that I'm absolutely still a Krishan supporter. But I'm not. A biased person like y'all think I am. If I have spoken in y'all eyes bad about Jaden, I can speak good about her. So with that being said, I'm just a realist. Y'all are fans. I'm not a fan of anyone. I support who I support though. Okay. And with that being said, and I'm not, if a hit dog on holler, if you took it like that, that's how you take it. But some people are fans and some people just support people. I'm one. I just support people. I don't even like fans. I don't want you to ever say you a fan of me. We family. We more like cousins. You know what I'm saying? I come to y'all every day. We talk our shit. We do our thing. That's it. That's all. You know what I'm saying? But with Jaden, I feel like this is a moment where she has stepped up. Like, I feel like, I feel like sis is up. Okay. <laughs> I feel like she says, you know what? I ain't going to play with him. Even if right now she just decide, I'm just going to rock with Shorty until he get out. I respect that. <laughs> like real shit. And I think that this is just, kind of Jaden's last rodeo I'm hoping I'm not gonna lie I hope it's Jaden's last rodeo uh with Blueface and his shenanigans that's just genuinely how I feel about the whole situation um she decided to stop following Cuh and you know she still has his children she's still you know handling her business and I'm sorry if the the reception kind of go in and out with the camera y'all I'm doing what I can but I think that She's deciding that she's going to choose her this time. And I hope she keep it like that. That's all I got to say about that. <clears throat> now, the next thing we're going to talk about is Blueface is um, currently out of gin pop. <laughs> what the fuck happened? I think his ass over there fighting like he, everybody know he's fighting. But I think that they trying to protect him before his ass get hurt. Um, as we previously reported, Blueface recently found himself back in L.A. County Jail after violating his probation in 2021 assault case. However, sources reveal that his time behind bars is far from the typical inmate experience. In fact, compared to most inmates, Blueface seems to have it relatively easy. Law enforcement sources told TMZ that Blueface is being kept in the administrative segregation area. OK, effectively keeping him out of the general population. This means he has a cell all to himself, which is true. Krishan said that that's true. Providing him with privacy and personal space. He can enjoy his meals without the hustle and bustle of a crowded mass hall. And they are brought directly to his cell. Now, why Blueface over there acting like he uh, on the movie of life, <laughs> the, the movie, um, the life movie? <laughs> Life, life, he act like he over there holding it down like niggas is trying to take his cornbread, okay? While Blueface movement is restricted, he 
is allowed up to seven hours a week to participate in educational classes or religious services, assuming they are available per the outlet. Additionally, he can spend time on the rooftop yard to make phone calls to his family or lawyers. These privileges allow him to maintain some sense of connection and engagement with the outside world. Damn, that nigga spoiled. <laughs> what did y'all get from that? I think he's spoiled. Um, Carlos said, just him and the Lord now. I pray he sees everything he needs to see and hears everything the Lord tells him it's about time. Okay, oh, that schoolyard crip can't make it to Gen Pop, huh? <laughs> I bet it's because Crack Rock, oh, my God, said uh, he had personal. He had a personal phone in his cell. She's the police, never commit a crime in front of her. She is, she's his biggest op. Uh, I don't I don't know if she's his biggest op, but I will say Krishan will tell you everything that is going on. You cannot tell Krishan everything if you don't want everybody to know because she going to tell it. <laughs> now, that's a fact. I don't think she's just telling on some snitching shit, but she, she will tell it. He going to come home and swear he did hard time. <laughs> I wonder how many boyfriends he got already. He's in PC protective custody. Uh, why the updates? Um, why are they trying to make uh, ADM sick? I don't know. Sound like a five-star suite, though. Personal space, food delivery, and rooftop calls. Oh, God. That's solitary. Dear Jason Beloved. Dear Jason Beloved, we don't care this much. Lock his second baby mama up, too, and his mama. Damn. Soldier Boy shooting people. Who asked for this update? It's a beautiful day at Zeus today. <laughs> I just wanted to talk to y'all about that. Um, do y'all think this is true? Knowing Jason Lee is very much so true. Um, he probably tried to find out what his boyfriend was doing in uh, in jail. Okay, and I'm only saying that because y'all know Jason Lee like Blueface. Have a sense of humor. It's a joke. All right. Um, all right, y'all. So <clears throat> I tried to give y'all Saucy Santana and um, Candy at the end. Candy is... Um, well, he's been on Love and Hip Hop, Wildin' Out, things like that. But they into it right now, um, basically because Candy dissed Santana. But Candy dissed Santana because um, Santana was in a club one time when uh, Candy was trying to sit in the section. But he was trying to sit in the section because he was talking to one of the guys that was in the section. Girl, it was a lot. But since Santana want to say mother ever, mother ever, mother ever, mother ever, mother ever. Um, every two to two to three words, not sentences, words. Um, they yellow boy me. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep the video just like this. Y'all let me know what y'all thinking about this down in the comment section below. Y'all know I got to get my eight minutes. All right. Um, but let me know. And that's all we got, man. Make sure y'all tap into the Patreon. All the links down in my uh description. Love y'all, appreciate y'all. Hey yeah.